Hello guys. And today I'm doing Mega Man 10. For the Nintendo Wii. And the uh, quality sucks. I'm gonna be playing as Mega Man and Proto Man for the sake of the walkthrough. And I'm gonna be playing in easy mode. Because that's the only mode that I'm good at. That doesn't matter though. I'm gonna be doing one Robot Master per episode because of the limited time on the camcorder. Yeah, I'm using the camcorder because I don't have a screen. I don't possess any capture card of any sort, which sucks. Because I'm out of luck when it comes to capturing my So it's a little bit speed runny, I'm sorry, that's just the camera's fault. Not mine. And I don't want to do like two cards for each thing because I gotta overload them separate times. But what if? Anyway, this is the first mini boss. Pretty standard crap. I just want to get done with him and hopefully I can do the stage in three minutes. So, if you want, you can get a little oh, power up. And yeah. Um, the strike man stage, especially in easy mode, is probably one of the least challenging. Um, but you got some challenges here and there. Definitely those guys aren't one. But you know the baseball throws can't say like lob your shots and underhand shot and it can be kind of annoying sometimes. But anyway, grab the screws because they're used as currency and you know, you have a shot. But yeah. Anyway, just keep them walking up the ladders, then you can do it. This weapon will restore everything. Your weapon energy, your uh, life. It's pretty cool. Anyway, keep on shooting these. Um, get a free E-Tank over here, because, you know, it's an E-Tank. And E-Tanks can store all your life in your position. Um, this guy actually has electric things around him. And they're kind of hard to dodge. But, you know, for the sake of the walkthrough, I'm going to kind of be getting hit by a drum. So I can be faster and quicker. But anyway... Killer Lock guy, I honestly have no idea why, but you know, Capcom is just like, hey, lockers, they're kind of evil. Whatever. Uh, okay. I'm not gonna kill that guy because that'll just take away the Just kidding, I did, haha. <laughs> you fell for it. But at least you're watching my videos, and at least you're not minding. Okay, you probably are. But we're near Strike Man anyway, so. Uh, just keep on shooting these, and yeah, it's kind of a boss time. Boss time! Uh, yeah. Anyway, let's go to Strike Man. This is Strike Man, he's weak to the Triple Blade, but he's not possessed the Triple Blade. So we're just gonna have to stick to our trusty old hand buster. But it's okay because his attacks are hate to avoid. Anyway, uh, sort of. It's kind of down here, but it's not good, right? Man, I used to do no damage on this guy. Strike, man. What happened to you? Did you go on cocaine or something? I don't know, man. Man, how you been? Dude, you're turning into a basketball and stuff. And I don't even care, actually. Anyway, the rebound strike was gonna try to crash into you, but we're almost done, so yeah. Anyway, that was Strike Man. And he's pretty, pretty easy, okay? Yeah. So, just grab his power. And yeah. Anyway, we got the Rebound Striker from Strike Man, and the Rebound Striker is just the ball that you throw, and you can shoot it, and it'll bounce off walls and stuff. Anyway, go save the game. And, uh, yeah. So, yeah. Anyway, now that we're Strike Man, we're gonna go after Sheet Man. But, uh, I'm not gonna have enough time to actually get to shoot man. But, 
I think I'm actually gonna end here, so bye bye.